Jacob, uh, this is a very tight game, so uh, a 1-0 defeat must be uh, an utter disappointment. How do you see the game? Yeah, a bit disappointed with the result, but uh, you, can, you can't take it away from Vanuatu. I think uh, they deserve to win today. We've tried our best, we had our chances, but uh, unfortunately luck is not on our side today. Like after that initial chance for Vanuatu, you really controlled the first half. You controlled the midfield, but you didn't seem to be able to get through the Vanuatu defence. Yeah, I think um, what we did in the first half was uh, we played too wide, so we don't have the chances to uh, beat the defence line. But uh, in the second half, we play a bit more closer to each other and uh, we create chances, but unfortunately we, di we didn't put the chances away. So it really comes back and hit us with the uh, chance with that corner kick and they put that goal away. Do you think the home crowd played a role in this game? Well, in any, any tournament, you always get support from the crowd. So they're the 12 men on the field today. So what can you say? The boys played their heart out, but uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, the uh, game is not on our side today. You said before this is a grand final um, because obviously the, uh, uh, the next opponent, New Zealand, will be a tough task. So how are you going to regather your troops to stand up for what would be a historic result against New Zealand? Well, we just have to regroup. Uh, it's still one more game. So we just have to regroup and work on the things that we need to uh, fix before our game on Tuesday. Unfortunately, we only have one training day on Monday, so tomorrow is just recovery. And then Monday, we just have to come and walk through what we need to do against New Zealand. We haven't seen a New Zealand play, so we don't know what they're going to do against us. But uh, we just have to be prepared and ready for that game. Thank you very much and good luck. Thank you.